What's up guys, welcome to another video and today we're going to be doing some summons for uh, Jay, uh, this current boss of Jay who is one of one of my uh, you know, long, longest or oh, he's been he's been around one of the longest in terms of my viewers uh, he asked me to do, to do uh, summons for him for his birthday which coincidentally is around like New Year's time so he's been saving a lot of scrolls I'm pretty sure he's free to play so yeah, he's, he's gotten quite a lot so I hope I can get him something for his birthday we'll see so let's get started I will have to do um, some like maintenance he doesn't have enough room for me to store everything so um, I will have to like you know, evolve some of his fodder for him but that's okay like, I'll, I'll probably cut that part out um, before I upload the video so we should be good for uh, regarding that okay let's see I think we've already gone through like 10 these scrolls and we still haven't got a lightning yet last I, I summoned for him uh, I think maybe I think it was actually been a year now or maybe a few months can't remember but last time but last time um, unfortunately I summoned him a third of the red which is very unfortunate I hope I don't summon another one for him in fact I hope I can summon him like any lightning right about now oh there you go finally uh, okay never mind this is not very useful so pretty much almost anything but a Varad would be nice I have been getting a lot like a lot of troops personally so um, I just hope that that luck doesn't uh, carry over to Jay I haven't actually done like my own summons on on uh, video for a while and even on stream I haven't done it for a while but I guess to give people a bit of an update of what I've been getting recently pretty much like the last six nat fives or so, or so have all been dupes uh, the most recent one being a, a dupe Ganymede uh, prior to that it was like uh, my third Brandia from Transcendent Scroll um, I didn't summon that on stream I was summoning that um, I saw, I saw, I saw something with uh, a friend <clears throat> and uh, yeah I, I didn't I, I got shit all pretty much but uh, as far as the brand is concerned that was the second brand year for Transcendent Scrolls so actually last year I got the same thing which is very very saddening um And then, what else did I get? Uh, actually, I've forgotten the other uh, ones that I haven't really been getting much. Oh, finally. Well, wow. that was like 50 something scrolls, and that was only two lining. Uh, Lucian skill up. This guess is not the worst. Oh, also, actually no, I, I, I don't remember. The other one was uh, my fourth aerial was one of my recent summons. Um, then there's there some other dupes like uh, there was dupe Sierra, dupe Perna. Uh, yeah, I think like the most recent thing that I got, which was useful, was an Anavol. But that was like at least four months ago, I would like to say. So yeah, it's been a very long time, and I've, I guess, like, starting to feel the uh, the demoralization from getting like nothing for a very long time. But that's that's summon as well for you. Ah, uh, you know, I actually don't mind this guy. Uh, I've been trying him out in siege. He's actually not bad. The only problem is in siege, there's a lot of um, like fire units, like Garrow and stuff like that. So it makes it a little bit, oh, and also Kamun. So it makes it a little bit hard for, to use Ayunu, but against start, like, the teams that don't have it, he's pretty good. He's got a skill 1 stun, 100% uh, stun rate as well, which is pretty nuts. Oh, that's unfortunate. Don't like any of the, I don't really like any of the jack o' lanterns, I prefer maybe chilling, 
Jennings are okay, but the, the rest are... Even the light dark ones are pretty... crappy. I don't know if you need any uh, skill ups for that, but anyway. Uh, I'll be right back and uh, let me fix up his fodder. And we're back again. So let's continue on. I was just looking over at like what we've gotten. I think we've only gotten like three or four lightning. And we've almost gone up to a hundred scrolls. That is that is some bullshit rates. I'm I'm so sorry, Jay. I really hope that like by the end of it, you know, hopefully at least there'll be something there to to make up for it. But this is like worse than I've ever seen. Even when I I, I mean I did some summoning sessions before uh, for myself and I mean my rates weren't exactly very good but it weren't this bad, so so yeah. Which is the keep hoping. I probably should have also asked him whether he wants to keep any of these nat threes, but I don't know. I think he will still have a quite a lot of nat threes anyway, because uh, I don't think I can make enough room. Or I mean, I probably have like I have to like store some of them because there's not. I don't think there's enough um, fodders to level up, but. I think yeah, he'll, he'll like have a bunch to, to play around with. So hopefully there's at least like something there that he might need. I don't know. I'm not sure what a, what a net freeze he might need to build. He's been quite playing for quite a long time, so I'm sure he's, he would have had most of the important net free units built already. I didn't really check his monsters like um, to see what he what he has, but oh what. Oh, I'll let him, let him deal with that later on. Oh, Phantom Thief. I think, like, this guy... If you have nothing else to build, like, you could probably build him for the win raid if you need a DPS for that. I think he's actually pretty good for that. He's a pretty good single target burst damage dealer. He does pretty good, like, you know, like, he does high damage, so he's... I guess he would be similar to a Brandia in that, in that sense. Uh, does like a you know, large single target damage and you put put him on a vampire and he can probably heal himself back up quite easily. But I don't know, like that, that's if you have nothing else to really build. But then again, the Phantom Thieves, I mean not many of them are very good. So I don't know, I'm not sure if there's any that you would really save, you know, to, to build anyway. Not a pumpkin. I guess if he doesn't have a max skill chilling, that might be okay. At least there's like some lightning now, but even then, I think we're way, like, way below average. Like at least like at a fifty percent rate compared to normal. Oh, there we go. Oh, Rakshasa. Probably doesn't need it, because I'm sure he would have been able to do the uh, the HOH before they changed the system. Plus there was another, I think there was another recent uh, HOH or for Rakshasa, from memory. I can't remember. I'm just, I'm, I don't know, I might, I might be just losing my mind, but anyway. I think you only really need Hua anyway. I'm not. I I feel like the other ones, not really that great these days. Maybe the dark ones okay, but even then, I don't know. I I, I built most of the uh, Rakshasas, but I only use Hua. Uh, all right, I'm gonna be right back. Be right back again. All right, and we're back again. Let's continue. I think we'll be good on space now. Um, should be enough. Had to spend quite a while fixing it up, but anyway, that's okay. Uh, let's see. So pretty much from here, I can just like store them. Won't take that long. Or oh, I mean, store the spare stuff. Oh, oh. Now, wait a minute. I need to check. 
Does he have does he have this? I think it's not a dupe. Oh congrats. Congrats Jay. I hope th I hope this is a uh, well worth the wait. One of the best arena monsters available. All right, let's continue. That was that was a good one to pull. I just wasn't even looking at it, and then like I saw it come out I, at the very end. I was like, oh, that's actually not enough for. Kamun, I'm sure he's, I think he's probably have a Kamun already, but if not, then that's pretty good. Maybe he needs skill ups. I think a lot of people tend to need Kamun skill ups. Shiwa, Shiwa's actually not a bad unit. Um, if you're struggling with win raid, you can use her for that. She's a good starting unit, uh, especially for people who don't have Perna. Obviously, most people don't have Parana, but um, so she she's like a pretty good replacement in a way because she's the she's on a fire attack lead because you're gonna stack fire units anyway. The reason to use Parana would be for the uh, the, t the attack lead, but the the nine tower one is pretty close to it. It's a little bit weaker, um, but it's it's not bad. She also does branding, so not a bad unit for win raid if you're struggling with that. I think she also heals herself too, which is nice. Not by a lot, but at least a little bit. Alright, so I mean that was about 170-ish rolls, I think, for a, a piece armor. Well, that's pretty good. Let's hope we can get him at least one more, considering how long he's been like waiting just like for these to be summoned. Oh another Phantom Thief. <coughs> oh, almost back to back lightning. It's pretty good. Oh, another Lucian skill up. Can't really complain about Lucian skill ups. Even for me, I wouldn't mind like more jokers, just because like in case I get a Libri later, because my Lucians are already like you know strong enough for what I need them to be at. Um, they're not all at max skill, but their amps are, are maxed. But I wouldn't mind some in case like I summon a Libri in the future, which at the moment looks pretty unlikely because the past few LD lightning I've gotten were all HOH monsters, so I don't know. I'm pretty overdue for something. Maybe it's a Libri. But I guess you can always fuse Joker Scubs if you need to. It's just very time consuming and very energy consuming as well because you're going to have to like farm a lot for mids. I never. Oh, one second. Uh, oh, never mind. This is uh, another Ayuno. I also uh, never never realized like how much of a struggle mids were because I don't. I mean, I never used to like make skill ups, right? I only made skill ups recently for uh, Garo and what's the other one? Uh, Harmonia. Uh, oh, Julie's actually Julie's not bad for siege these days. Uh, but yeah, like I didn't re really realize the uh, the struggle with mids because I never needed to make or like, to like um, awaken many three stars for like longest time. But yeah, now it's like really tough. So I've been like doing the unlimited energy on Magic B Seven to get mids. So like, yeah, like because people used to always complain, I never really got it because I was like. Why do you need to evolve? I mean, awaken so many units. But yeah, now I get it. Now for Julie, I think she's actually pretty good for siege against all the Garo teams. Uh, I think a lot of my guildies tend to use that, uh, use her for, you know, to, to counter that because she's a multi hitter. She does a lot of damage, like pretty good damage too. I think she's like Stella in a way uh, because, like, for Stella, she doesn't. Or if you watch my siege video. Um, I killed a Garo without attack buff or defense break, right? Obviously, it would be much easier if I had it, like those available, but I didn't. So, um, um, but I still killed the Garo anyway. 
And yeah, I think Julie could probably do something similar to that. Just because Garrow doesn't have much HP, or like, not really built on much HP. Another Rakshasa, I feel like getting the same Nat 4s over and over. Seeing so many repeats of these. No other, like, unique ones. I probably wouldn't mind getting him, like, at least some Sky Dancers. I'm sure he'll probably need Sky Dancers. Everyone needs Sky Dancers. Oh! Oh, actually, I don't know. Triton? I mean, it's a Nat 5. Let me check if it's a, um, a dupe. That's not bad, though. Two Nat 5s. I haven't even gotten, to, gotten into the legendaries yet. Oh no, he's already got one! It's not even ruined! Oh man, I'm sorry Jay. Alright, one dupe, but at least got one... One good one. One good non-dupe. Alright, let's see if we can... Uh, get it one more that's uh, like a bit more useful than that. Unfortunately, uh, I mean, I was trying to like disconnect my chat, but for some reason it didn't work. So, because I wanted to make it, um, I wanted to make it spoiler three for for those, you know, the, his guilties. Um, I just hope like they don't tell him until like, until he watches the video. But yeah, I, mean, I was trying to disconnect it so that at least like the guilties guilty wouldn't know what he got. And then they can watch it and you know not get spoiled as well. But unfortunately it didn't work. I thought I did it correctly, but oh. Well. It was too late now since uh, I already summoned the, the, the Nat fives. Okay, Mr. Scrolls Mystical Scrolls is done. Ah, oh, no more lightning. I think I was like, was that no lightning after that Triton? Oh well. I mean I was actually hoping it was Okeanos for him. Okeanos would be pretty nice. Because I, I, mean, I saw uh, it was a Sea Emperor. I was hoping it would be an Okeanos because, you know, he's, he's like the best one. Unfortunately, it was... It was Wind. Alright, another Cobalt Bomber. Not sure if he's going to skill up any, but... I mean, I guess it's fine to have it in case. Let's see. It's gonna be another Nat 4 to talk about. Something more. Something newer. Instead of like the same dupes. Nope. Oh, there we go. What is this one? Uh, I, ha I have. I actually have. Honestly, I have no idea how this guy works. I don't know what his skills do, but uh, increased defense, decrease. Uh, I don't know. I've never seen anyone use this guy. I don't see it being very good, but <laughs> you can, I guess you can always uh, skill up a uh, what's his name, the blue one, the blue Horus, if you want to build a Katarina team. Oh, two lightning from fire. Oh, it's a Platy. Actually, Platy's not bad. I think the mermaids now, because they got buffed, they actually both like they're actually pretty good. Or well, at least the uh, wind and the um, fire one is. Fire one, I believe, the skill one is a, a like a. It's improved to make it to be a uh, 100% strip when you awaken her. And the third skill, I think, what did they change? Uh, I think it strips as well, and then like resets or something. It's not bad. It's not a bad unit. I would build one if I had enough mermaid skill ups. But I'm trying to like I'm trying to skill up the win one first. I wish I kind of wish now that I had um, farmed the the mermaid HOH more when it was back when you could farm it. Uh, well, that's all the elementals. Now hopefully we can get him an, a light, lightning from LD. That's quite a lot. It's like 20 LDs. So let's see, let's hope for something there. I'm gonna just make some more room so I don't have to uh, fix it up later. I think it's plenty of space now. I saw he's got like he's one of the few people I know who farm the Angel Mon dungeon. He's got so many in storage. He's gonna have a, 
have a ball just like powering everything up. I guess he can spend all his water ones on his new peace armor though. Alright, start with LD and then we'll do the legendaries. Okay, two the two hobbies are okay. I don't know, he probably already has them though. Uh, no. I actually built that marble a really long time ago. It was very underwhelming. Basalt. A lot of people were chasing basalt. I hope he... I wonder if he has it actually. At least it'll be like a decent F3. If he if he uh, doesn't need, doesn't uh, have it. Wow, don't tell me I'm gonna go 20 with no lightning. Just give me one. No. Oh come on, the lightning rate shouldn't be this bad. Oh man, I feel I feel terrible. Come on, this ah oh, finally got one. Dover, ah uh, man, that's actually kind of disappointing because like. Alright, he's not a bad unit. I actually use him in Guild Wars, but like... I don't feel like he's a nat 4 unit. I mean, he, he, this buddy thing is actually not bad. Um, I actually used him in my latest Siege video. Uh, the way it works is... Alright, so obviously he becomes best friends with the, the lowest HP unit, right? And then based on how much HP they have, um, it gets a buff, so... If you have like max HP, I think it's like green HP or something, you would get um, attack buff. And then like in the middle, you will get HP recovery, and if you're like red health, you'll get endure. Uh, at least I believe that's how it works. I've only used it like once or twice, but yeah. Like basically, it's like a. Alright, um, assuming you get first turn, right? It's basically a Teon slash Garuda, like in that you can resurge. And give attack buff at the same time, right? But he also has much higher base speed than them. He's got 104 base speed, whereas the uh, the Garudas have like 90 something. Like so, yeah, it's much easier to make him fast, basically. I mean, I guess it's okay. Well, hang on, let's yolo this last one. Nope. All right, let me just let me double check. Does he have a basalt? Uh, where's his storage? I don't think he's got a basalt, so that's good at least. Wait, let me check by net threes. Uh... Oh, he does not have a basalt. Okay, that's good. At least he's got something new. Oh, he plus the Dover, I guess. Uh, wait, let's lock this one. I want to lock his basalt just so, just in case he needs, he wants to build it. I'm pretty sure he will build it though. It's good for TA way hard, for like a safe team. I will also maybe lock uh, his harpies or one of each, because they're okay for like late game. I think he needs anything else. So, All right, let's do the legendaries, then we can finish off. All right, just one more nat five would be nice. Non dupe. All right, another. That's a third eye, you know. Damn. Another. Oh my god, another cobalt bomber. And so yet the. I summoned this one as well. Jeez. Uh, what? Another. Another windy. Oh my god. That's, that's Oh okay, something different. Alright, Harmonia, she can be she can be uh fused, but at least she's a she's a good unit at least. And like, you know, decent skill up. Orion obviously like one of the most annoying Guild War and Siege units for defense. Shimite was a HOA, that's unfortunate. Cases long she was like one of my, one of my first Nat fours. Actually she kinda carried me through like the early game. She was very good back then. Must not so much anymore. 
Another fusion monster. At least there's a skill up for Garrow if you're building one. Alright, lucky last. Can I get one more Nat 5? No. Wait, oh, okay, there's another. Oh my god, same, same Nat 4s. Jeez, that's a lot of Dream Nat 4s. I mean, at least they're decent families for like skill ups. Alright, so this is pretty much like all the Nat 4s I got. I, I, I like. Um, I stored like the fake Nat 4s because they're whatever. But from. I would like to say about. 300 plus scrolls, plus uh, not including the uh, legendaries. That's a uh, pretty disappointing rate, I think. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Um, 28. And eight of, those, of them were legend from legendaries. So that's about, I think on average it was about 20 net fours per. Like 300 scrolls when you include the uh, elementals. That's really well below average, but at least he's got a peace armor. Something new to play with. Um, pretty good for arena too. I mean, uh, for uh, like his offense team. I'm not sure what he's going to do with the triton. I think you can just store it for now. Maybe you can like use it as a skill up for your future Okeanos. Alright, but that's it from me. Uh, thanks again to Jay for letting me summon on his account uh, it was it was it helped keep, keep uh, it helps me uh, like you know stay away from summoning like in a way like as in it's it uh, I, mean, I get very itchy to summon and like that kind of helps alleviate that so thank you again and gives me something to record all right so I'll be fixing up the video to like you know uh, cut out stuff that like all the like um all the fodder feeding and all that so that you don't deal with that um so thanks again guys for watching and i hope i see you guys in the next video Bye bye